Hello, uh, my name's Neil Otts, O-T-T-S is the spelling, I'm on the last name. I recently applied with Maverick Transportation back in October of 2017. I've known for a couple of weeks now that they had a uh, orientation class going in on the 31st of December and that I was going to be an alternate for that class and luckily I was called in for that spot, that alternate spot on the 2nd of January 2018. However, I was so far behind in the orientation process that the instructors there, um, who by the way are class acts, uh, I mean top-notch individuals, uh, man they care about you, they want to see you succeed through this program, um, they let me know that the process for me was going to be uh, to go ahead and go through medical, uh, get my physical, drug test, uh, vision test, um, abilities, test, I passed all those things. Then I went into orientation, uh, done a few minor things with them, some testing that I had to get done before I could go to Newport. Then they let me know that I was going to go ahead and go to Newport and get that training, but then I would come back to Little Rock with the class like normal, but I would go into orientation um, on that Sunday after we get back to Little Rock. Purpose of this video is really to go through the CDL training process uh, with you, I'll let you know what that consists of. I know there's some other guys out there doing videos that uh, they're top notch as well. Uh, they're, they drive for Maverick. I have watched their videos numerous times, every one of them. Uh, and I'm being serious about that. Uh, go back and watch them. Uh, my wife will even tell me, hadn't you already watched that? And I have, but I, I just continue to learn from these guys. Matter of fact, those individuals that have those videos, they uh, influenced me so much. See, I was going into TCD, uh, temperature control uh, division, and I decided to go ahead and go flatbed, regional Midwest division, uh, because of them and their, their videos. Uh, they influenced me that much. Uh, I appreciate that very much. And I'm not trying to compete with them. I'm just trying to give you another aspect. Uh, because like I said, I'm going to have to go through this training process in Newport, Arkansas. What happened today was it began the process of going to Newport. We actually moved up to Newport. Um, I say that like I did. I only, I'm only about 15 minutes south of there. So I'm staying at my house uh, during this process, which is uh, very lucky for me to be able to do that. Uh, I'm, I'm thankful for that. The other guys got moved into the house this morning. Uh, they unloaded their gear there. Then we all loaded up in the Maverick van and went over to the university. They put us in a classroom. The instructors came in, introduced themselves to us, told us what to expect, and I'm, I was impressed. Uh, as a matter of fact, I, I have a permit already, a CDL permit. So what that means is I've already took the written exam, uh, general knowledge, air brakes, combination vehicles. Um, I, I've already took those, passed those, so I have a permit. Uh, just like a, I guess, you know, it'd be similar to a teenager having a uh, permit to drive just a, a normal vehicle, you know, a, cl a regular Class D license. Um, I actually had a Class B uh, CDL at one time, and so in order to get to Class A, um, I just had to take a few minor parts of that test. Uh, completed those, so I'm good to go on that. These other people uh, these other students, um, guys and gals that signed up for this class, they had to go over to the revenue office today. Uh, Maverick fed us lunch after we met with those instructors, and then the instructors came and got those uh, students from the house, took them over to the revenue office, and here's where things get a little tricky, you might say. Uh, not really, but here's what happened. If you are coming in from out of state, then you have to transfer your driver's license from your state into Arkansas in order to be able to get this training. Costs forty-five dollars, I think, maybe fifty. That's money that comes out of your pocket. You have to do that. Okay, and then once that's completed, you provide proper documentation, whether it's birth certificate, um, passport, whatever it might be. You can get a CDL packet from the revenue office, which cost $50 normally. For these students, they didn't have to pay that. Uh, that was part of the tuition cost. 
the school is paying that. Maverick's paying the school for your training and because they're going to offer you a job at the end of this training. And then um, you will work for them for six months, at least six months, in order to pay that tuition back um, or you'll owe them that. But anyway, back to the topic at hand here, the revenue office getting your license. Um, so they've been given these pamphlets today, these pro, these uh, uh, CDL training uh, booklet. Instructors told them today, start reading. Tonight, start reading. They have a week to study um, five sections, I believe it is. I think there was three sections in general knowledge and then the air brakes and the combination vehicles that they need to master. They need to ace that test next Thursday in order to move on to the next phase. We're only, you're only given so many chances to pass this. And, uh, you know, to quote the instructor up there today, he basically told us this. He said, we will train the crap out of you if you will let us. Um, so what that's telling me is the ball's in our court. We can be successful in this program. That's what Maverick wants us. That's what they've preached to us over the last couple of days. They want us to be successful. They are investing money and time in us, so they want us to succeed in this program. Hey, uh, I'd appreciate it if you'd like this video. Uh, give me a thumbs up on it. Subscribe to my channel. Uh, I know this is just starting out, uh, and I'm not trying, like I said earlier, I'm not trying to compete with those guys. Um, I will tell you this, though. My email address is in the info button, uh, a little pull-down tab there on the right underneath this video, a little arrow. Uh, pointing down, you can click on that. A little bio comes up about me. And then um, I've also got my email address in there. Shoot me an email uh, if you got a question, or you can leave a question in the comments underneath this video, and I'll try to reply back to it. I may not know the answer, uh, but I'll, I'll, I'll find somebody that does if I don't. And also, uh, last but not least, if you're interested in Maverick Transportation, uh, Shoot me over your name and address, uh, your phone number, and I'll get a recruiter to give you a, a call. They'll, they'll reach out to you. Uh, if you don't want to do that route, give them my name, Neil Otts. Last name's O-T-T-S. Uh, yes, we do get referral bonus uh, for people coming in. Uh, unexperienced or experienced, it doesn't matter. Uh, they're looking for drivers. And a uh, matter of fact, they told us today that within their pipeline, um, there's a there's a shortage right now of the number of people that they were expecting to have in their pipeline by this time of this year, even though it's early. So uh, they're they're still looking, and um, if you're interested, uh, I think it would be a good fit for you. I can tell you this: uh, a good friend of mine that went through this program, the same CDL training program, highly recommended this. He's working for Maverick. Talked to him today on the telephone. Um, he's in the temperature control division and uh, absolutely loves it. So, um, and that's, that's another thing that sold me to this company. So, like I said, if you don't mind subscribing to my channel, give me a thumbs up. And uh, stay tuned, because uh, I'll be posting videos every day, hopefully. Thank you.